so it is Monday morning and um, we're all go this week. Obviously we move house on Saturday. So this week is all about getting packed up and ready to go. Um, I will have hopefully by now put up our kind of bumper vlog from the weekend which was just so full on. It was such a good time getting to celebrate my sister's hen party and do all of that stuff but I have come away from that weekend just so exhausted but with no time at all to kind of rest and recuperate because I've just got to hit the ground running. I've got some freelance work that is due this week. Obviously we move house on Saturday and we've packed maybe two boxes in total so I've really really got to get on and do that. Um, and yeah, just all go, go, go. The new kitchen is being delivered on Friday. The kitchen floor should be going down this week. Meg's room should be getting plastered. Um, we ordered carpets for the kids yesterday, um, but they don't come till the 31st. So we've got to kind of think about room setups until their carpets are laid because there's no point building the furniture until the new carpets have gone down. And just, it's really gonna be a huge, juggling act this week so I will do my best to keep you going um to keep you coming along with us you know I've committed to doing vloggist and whether my vlogs are two minutes long or ten minutes long I am going to stick this out because I committed to doing it um so yeah let's just get on I'm gonna sit down and do some work I'm kind of trying to intersperse doing some freelance work with packing a box with watching the kids basically although the kids are being amazing this morning and just getting on and playing which is brilliant so yeah I'm kind of doing half an hour's freelance work and then half an hour's packing half an hour's freelance work and then half an hour packing so we'll see how that kind of plays out for the rest of the day but that is my plan and yeah I've just got to get on and do it <laughs> into the afternoon now and we are popping out to run some errands I need some more parcel tape and some bin bags to help me do the packing and I also missed a parcel delivery on Friday which is really annoying because our post office is about 25 minutes away so it's not easy and straightforward to go and get um, and I'm also out with a Thunderbird and what are you an X-wing pilot. pilot so Thunderbirds are go We made a decision that when we moved we were going to get rid of all the cheap plastic stuff for, that we've had for the kids for so many years because now they're a little bit bigger they can kind of cope with this glass stuff I mean it's still just cheap glass stuff from Ikea but um, I honestly cannot wait this cupboard this entire shelf is just full of crappy plastic bits and I cannot wait to chuck them away I have done so much packing today that I have actually run out of boxes um, so hopefully James is going to bring me some more boxes tomorrow but I'm feeling really good about the progress that I managed to make today I packed up all of the lounge I packed up the kids lounge and I packed up some of our Welsh dresser and we've got like kind of a tall pantry thing and I packed that up as well so I didn't quite make it through to the kitchen but overall I feel like if I can keep this pace up then 
we should be pretty good to go on Friday. Um, so right now I'm just running myself a bath because I am such an old woman. Um, I ache so much um, and I think it's from quad biking on Saturday morning because it was off-road quad biking and so you were just bouncing up and down like this the whole time and so my body just really really aches particularly my wrists I think I have trouble with my wrists anyway and I think the vibration through the handlebars has just really um, set them off so Oh yeah, I'm going to have a relaxing bath. James has gone out to watch the Everton match with his friend, so not really going to get too much done, especially not having any boxes. I can't really do too much else. I could probably swing some cleaning, but I'm not really feeling that today. So yeah, I'm going to sign off here. I'm going to go in the bath, hopefully try and finish um, a quart of mist and fury, which I am slogging my way through. I'm about 100 pages from the end. Now, but it's just taking me so much longer to read this than it did to read Akatar, it's ridiculous. Um, so yeah, I will see you all tomorrow.